I'm going to tell you a, a story here about a guy called Troy Peterson. And ultimately, this is a guy who lives in the great state of Minnesota. Now, Minnesota really isn't known for its startup. It's not, it's not really a Silicon Valley or New York, I'm sure you agree. However, you know, Troy is a very innovative, very clever. He's not a coder. He's kind of like me. I like Troy because actually Troy gave me the, 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 the desire and inspiration. And in Minnesota, he's regarded as one of a of a figure, and I think the reason why Troy likes to be in Minnesota is he's, he stands out, whereas if he was in Silicon Valley in, in New York, just be one of many, you know. And he came up with this really innovative idea called Nibipedia, or Nibisoft, where he assembled a team and tried to launch this, you know, this software that basically takes video and wikis, combines them for searching and other things, right, uh, to find really, you know, cool educational content and everything else, all right? So, basically, um, you know, software was around in 2009, and actually, you know, he, he really innovative, really cutting edge. And the way we connected, because I had something at the time, and I still do, ed and thing that deals with, um, you know, education also, and also something called Wikipedia. But being in, you know, being in uh, Minnesota, he couldn't really... Um, you know, raise money, and, and here comes these Angel Gate guys, and these, I don't know how many of these guys are actually on Angel Gate, I know Dave McClure is, is an Angel Gate guy, um, I think, um, you know, there's a bunch on here, but these, what I, when I say Angel Gate, let's, let's be very, let's, it's the insider club, it's the, it's, you know, it's the traditional club um, that stems from the British Empire, the good old boy club, you see all the women listed on this, on this thing, well, they put their money behind these guys, QWiki, now QWiki is you know, and you look at this guy. Who do you, you know, this guy's handsome. This guy's ugly. I mean, you know, this guy is in Minnesota, right? This is in Minnesota, whereas QWiki is in, you know, uh, New York and LA in San Francisco. So these guys, this is the difference. You're either inside, right, or you're outside. And ultimately, these guys are raised with $10 million funding today, over $10 million. So, um, and really, their product is nowhere near as as cool. But but they got these guys behind them, these Angel Gate Co. guys. So because of that, poor you know Troy was like, well, I'm gonna have to file for bankruptcy. My investors are now coming at me. Nothing's happened. These guys control. These guys have invested in, you know, uh, QWiki. He's got some patents, but his patents are useless unless he got money. Patents are useless, you know. T um, you know, they're, they're, you might as well just file provisional patents in the hope that you can become like these guys, right, um, and have the support. And here's an example where they were trying to secure funding and ads executive. This is back in 2009. Nearly, this is, this is a year before QWiki, all right. However, Look at these, none of these are part of the Angel Gate crew, right? They're never part of the insiders. So what did, what did uh, Troy do? Well, being frustrated, he decides to do something that is, that is basically my domain. You know, let's do the Wikitube. Claim that Wikitube is a generic prize, even though Binkley owns the registered mark for downloadable software for Wikitube. Um, I haven't applied. So out of, I think out of spite, he just decides to like, hey, let's, you know, let's like see if I can piss uh, Trout off. And even though I told him, why don't you do Wiki TV or some other thing? Why would you want to step on my, you know, on, on something that I've been working hard on for the last year? So, you know, and here's our Wiki TV. It has the trademark on it. We were the first to basically uh, do uh, um, streaming Google, all right? Auto autoplay Google. We were the first. We had over a year. We had playlists. Here are the playlists down here on the side here. Um, really cool. Basically, by you know, six months, I was trying to raise money. Again, I didn't understand this whole insider thing. Here comes YouTube, and they launched something called Lean Back. Exact duplicate of what we're doing. All the different features, all the bells and whistles. So at that point, I put things on hold, and that was the birthday. That's when Phelps, and I said, listen, I'm going to disrupt these Angel Gate fuckers. I'm going to change things, and, you know, we've got to level the playing field. So part one of a part two. I hope you'll listen to the second one.